five of Lick Friday, and this week's lick, um, I've, I've put this one over a D minor track which I did a long time ago, which was uh, under the title of a, a Yingwe or Yingui, whatever you want to say it, I don't really know, uh, Malmsteen track. Um, so yeah, it's in the key of D minor. It's quite a quick lick, but it's certainly not um, in the style of Yingwe, Yingui, whatever he is. Someone please correct me if I am wrong in any of those. Um, so yeah, it's not in the style of him, but it's a, a pentatonic lick, um, but it's still quite quick. So you've got some nice sort of uh, patterns reoccurring through this, and some nice sort of licks you can take from it. So. Um, it's all in 16th notes, so um, the rhythm of it is fairly straightforward. It just feels like it slightly changes towards the end uh, to more of a sort of triplet sort of feel, but it's still 16th notes. So, um, And uh, yeah, I'm going to zoom in for it, but before I do that, before I zoom in, um, firstly, thanks everybody for keep coming back um, weekly and uh, looking at these uh, Lick Fridays. I know a lot of you enjoy them and uh, learn from them, learn new licks obviously, and uh, sort of use them in your own playing which is great, so that's one of the reasons I'm doing it. So, um, If you're into your social media and things like that, then my Instagram is the Guitargram and my Twitter and Facebook are Danny Page Music. Um, all of which have different things on from time to time, so get on that and get downloading uh, all the PDFs for this lesson and the previous lessons as well, um, which are all free from the website, which is guitarjammingtracks.com. So yes, here we go. I'm going to zoom in, so I will bring in that closer so you can see the fretboard. There we are. See you in a minute. Here we go. Along with the track. Let's break this little bugger down for you. Um, now, before we jump in, so you're using D minor, um, so the actual shape itself for the pentatonic zone. Um, let's take that load of gain off. We've got. So that's uh, fret 10, and you've got basically 10, 13 on this is string by string, two notes per string. So you've got 10, 13, 10, 12, 10, 12, 10, 12, 10, 13, 10, 13. If you're unsure of your pentatonics, then get onto my website and uh, obviously the YouTube video for um, how to nail the five positions of the pentatonic fast, I think it is. Um, but the link is in the description bit below, so um, get on that. Now, breaking it down for you. So, as I say, it's all 16th notes, so I'm just going to sort of run through it, um, and then uh, we'll go from there, or you can go from there anyway. So, uh, use the hammer-ons and uh, pick wherever you want. I, ha I have indicated a few on the sheet, but, um, you know, put them in where you feel like you need to. Some people could pick it all the way through, some people can't. I kind of use a combination of the two. So, here we go. It starts on the fourth string, so the D string, 10th fret. And you're going to pick the 10. I hammer on to the 12, but you can pick it. So you've got 10, 12. Next string is 10, 12. So that's the third string, 10 and 12. Then straight across, back to the fourth string, to 12. So those five notes are... Then you do the same sort of pattern following the pentatonic shape on the third string, which is going to be 10, 12. Hammer down. Then on the second string you've got 10, 13, and then 12 on the third string. So note the fingers I'm using for these. Okay, then you've got uh, 10, 13, oh, there's the phone going funny again, there we go. Right, so then you've got 10, 13 on the second string, use a hammer on for that if you want to. Then it's 10, 13 on the first. Then 13 on the second, and then 10 on the first. So that little section will be. Then I've got a annoying phone. Uh, then I've got 
after the uh, 10 on the first string, you're going to the 13 on the second string and sliding it up to the 15. So you get... Then it's going to be 13, 15, 13 on the first string. And then 15 on the um, second string. So... Now I would use 15 on the second string, I would use your second finger because the next part you are doing this. Okay. So that part, so 13, slide 15, and then you've got 13, 15, 13, 15, second finger, getting your first finger ready on the 13th fret, and then your little finger is going to the 17th fret on the first string pulling off to the 13 and then you've got the 15 with your second finger on the second string then you've got the 15th fret on the first string third finger I would say for this one pulling off to the 13 and then 15 on the second string um, so that would should sound something like then you've got 13 first string 15, 13, 15 second string to finish with a bit of vibrato. So um, I'll play it all slow for you now and then you can hear it. Here we go. And that was it. There we go. I'll zoom back out and say bye bye. Hey guys, so that was it. That was the uh, week 75 of Lick Friday. Um, hope you will learn something, if not all, of this lick. It's quite a cool little lick, so and but it's a little bit quick in places. Well, actually, all the way through, but it's quite nice to play, even at slower speeds. Apologies for the um, phone doing its thing on that. Um, so yeah, if you're, again, once again into your social media, it's the Guitargram is my Instagram, Facebook and Twitter are Danny Page Music. Next week, week 76, um, and uh, yeah, so that they'll keep coming. Rather nice. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves and you're going to have a great weekend. I'll see you next week for week 76. Latest, taters, bye.